New details now on a deadly crash on Friday on the East Beltline reveal that the driver who caused it had been drinking prior to the accident and empty bottles were found in his car. 1300 Sides' Keely Lover is joining us now from the newsroom. Keely, what other information did you learn today? Well, court, uh, Kirk, court documents tell us that 20-year-old Brian Parks is accused of causing that crash, admitting to drinking, and bottles of alcohol were found in his car. Just after 8 o'clock on Friday, September 30th, officers went to the intersection of Knapp Street and Beltline, East Beltline Avenue for a serious accident. When they got there, they saw a female victim dead lying in the median. She has since been identified as 54-year-old Clarissa Durant from New Mexico. Parks admitted to officers that he was driving the car that rear-ended her, causing her to roll over and ejected and ultimately killing her. Authorities said at the scene, Parks was unaware of his location and he was very compatible with officers. They also found a large empty bottle of vodka on his dashboard and there was vodka splashed all over the inside of his car, plus another alcohol bottle empty found under the seat. Now, Brian Parks was arrested on probable cause and he has been charged with OWI causing death and reckless driving causing death. He was arraigned this morning giving a $10,000 cash surety bond and he is expected to be back in court on October 11th. Now, according to court documents, witnesses told police that before the accidents, Parks was driving recklessly, even to the point where they felt they had to pull over to the side of the road to avoid being hit. Thank you, Keely.